ether, smoke, air, fire, and water. Hear it. Drive away all harm, fear, and negative energy. Only good may enter and dwell here in perfect positivity, peace, love, harmony, serenity, and protection. It is so, so it is, and so more to be. So be it, there it is done. Ashe, Ashe. Archangel Uriel to the north of me, Archangel Raphael to the east of me, Archangel Michael to the south of me, Archangel Gabriel to the west of me, Archangel Santa Paul beneath me, sending up the crystal grid line into my heart, and Archangel Metatron above me, sending down the creator like conscious to my heart and to my mind so that I may function in my true high vibrational radiant authentic self, bright self. I invoke thee, I command thee, and I um Invoke thee to place me in your pure bubble of white light and darkness of protection and the energies that um, I bring messages for. To place us in your pure bubble of white light and darkness of protection so no harm come before our scarred and sacred tents, our scarred and sacred space. It is so, so it is, and so must it be. Ashe, Ashe. Thank you, divine spirits. I welcome in my divine spiritual whole entire divine spiritual love war team i say i welcome in my ancestors my spirit guides my guardian angels my light angels my dark angels my archangels my fairies my um elves i welcome in my totem animals i welcome in my celestial beings i welcome in my divine ascended masters i say all the gods and goddesses i say I welcome you in in this present moment, Ashe, to surround me with your security, with your knowledge, with your wisdom, Ashe, the ancient wisdom, Ashe, to shield me and protect me in this divine moment as I bring forth messages for the collective, Ashe, Ashe, thank you, divine spirits, divine energy, divine protection, I thank you, Ashe, Ashe. Pure hands, pure heart, pure thoughts, and pure intentions to come over me in this present moment as I bring forth clarity. Ashe, Ashe. Thank you, divine spirits. I welcome you all in, Ashe, and I'm sending you loving, healing energy your way. Ashe, Ashe. Welcome, 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 and welcome back. All my divine infinite light beings, Ashe, excuse me for that. Ashe, I thank you for your likes, your subscribes, your shares, your comments, your love, your love, your love. I thank you for that. I appreciate that. I have much gratitude for that. Ashe, Ashe, all my returning subscribers, all my new subscribers, all the viewers, the cross watchers, the karmics. I appreciate you all, Ashe, Ashe. And I am a little spark of light coming to communion with you in this present moment, Ashe, to bring forth clarity to you in your life, Ashe. Just confirmation, Ashe, that, you know, what you already knew is being confirmed, Ashe. That, that in period, Ashe. Thank you, Divine Spirit, for that. I, I I am grateful to be the vessel that is bringing forth this message on this channel, Ashe. Divine Spirit is saying surrender. And this message will be for the um, energy of the community of the L L C B T Q plus community. I really hope I said that right. And I don't hope so. Y'all motherfuckers out there better stop fucking hoping. I'm tired of saying hope. I wish. I wish upon. Oh, I, I wish. I, look, look, look. I wish upon a star. That song is coming to me. 
So somebody is wishing upon you. Ashe. Um, Ashe. The LG B. Where I get LC? Excuse me. The LG B. The LG B. TQ plus community. I say I'm gonna get that shit right. Next time I ain't gonna need my phone. I say, I say, it's 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 it it'll come to me. I say, I say. But that is for the LGBTQ plus community. I send you all loving, healing energy. I say in this present moment, and spirit is saying it is time for you to surrender. I say. It is time for you to surrender and accept. So you could be 26 year old. You could have a four year old child. You could be a life past number four. Your name could be Robert. You could your name could be Priscilla. Um, Thomas. Peter. John. Larry. You have plenty of wisdom. We have a master number here, 22. So, um, you could be born on the 22nd of the month. You could have something to do on the 22nd of this month. Ashe, you could be a life path number four. Once again, two and two is four. Ashe. And so, we have sovereignty. So, God is saying it's okay to live a sovereign life even though you are attracted to the same sex. It's nothing. God is not um, putting any kind of judgment on you. You are able and God is saying you are willing. You are able and you have the will. To live a sovereignty life. Ashe. Pleasure. With pleasure. Ashe. So you could be born on the 18th of the month. Ashe. You could um, be in a group of 18 people. Ashe. You could be a life path number nine. Ashe. You could have the name of star. Ashe. You could like the color orange. Ashe. But spirit is saying surrender to the feelings that you are feeling. Ashe. Accept the feelings that you are feeling. Ashe. And people will accept you. You have the will. Do you have the wisdom? Ashe. There is nothing um, to be um, ashamed. There is nothing to be um, um, shunned for, Ashe. You are still an earth angel, Ashe. You are still a cosmic seed, Ashe. You are still a star, an a, 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 a empath, a um, light worker, a star. You are that, Ashe. Ashe, Spirit is saying, reach for the stars. Ashe, we just got that song, I wish, I wish upon a star. She's reaching for stars. So Spirit is saying, continue to reach for those stars that you are wishing upon. Ashe, Spirit is saying, stay in your intuition because you will receive the pleasure that you deserve, Ashe, in this bliss. Of happiness, Ashe, in this bliss of spirit, Ashe, in this sovereignty, Ashe. If you surrender to divine um, guidance, to divine um, um, timing, spirit is saying, accept who you are. Have the power to surrender, Ashe. So you could have a 16 year old brother. Ashe, you could have, um, uh, 
a seven year old, Ashe. You could have a 54 year old mother, Ashe. But surrender, um, spirit is saying, ether is saying, surrender to the power. And we are in this full moon energy. So spirit is saying, connect with this full moon energy right now. Why? Wow, it is potent. We have the master number 44, and we got 44 earlier. Ashe, 44. Four. Okay, attraction. So you are attracting your soul tribe. You are attracting um, what you desire. Um, by you surrendering, you will attract it even more. It, you have to trust, Spirit is saying. Have trust while you are in this incubation um stage have the knowledge and the wisdom to trust you could be 32 years old you could be 44 years old ashe but you have the attraction and spirit is saying you there is no reason to fear because um the divine is 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 covering you the the divine has you on all sides the divine protects you you are protected by your spiritual um Love war team, Ashe, because you are a, a chosen warrior, Ashe. You were chosen to, to fight this battle in this lifetime against those who come uh, uh, against those who come against you for um the preference or um the feelings that you have or um the the attractions that you are attracted to, Ashe. Because you are attracted to same-sex relations. So you have no fear, Ashe, because the divine backs you up. The divine has no judgment on you, Ashe. As other people place judgment on you, as other people do not accept you, Spirit is saying, have the wisdom, the knowledge to know that Spirit accepts you. And there is nothing um, un- um, um, there's nothing wrong with you um, loving the same gender. Ashe, Ashe. You could have been in a past life. Ashe, let me explain it to you. In a past life, okay, you, a woman in this life, right? Loving on a woman, Ashe. But in a past life, you could have been a man that embodied a woman this time, and that is why you are still attracted to a woman. Ashe, in this lifetime, you could have been a man attracted to a man, but in your past life, you could have been a woman. Ashe. So in this lifetime, you're embodying a man's um embodying a man's energy but you are still attracted to a woman because in a past life you were a man do you understand that spirit wanted me to break that down to you ashe because we live these lives over and over again and then we try to um be we try to um get it right each time that we relive these lives and this time in this lifetime you are awakening ashe so you are um embodying the the information the knowledge the wisdom that you need to accept yourself in this lifetime because you were chosen on this mission in 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 this form ashe release release any resistance that you have towards spirit your sovereignty, release any resistance that you have towards accepting yourself, release any exist any resistance that you have um, opening your powers, opening up to your powers, any resistance that you have um, towards surrendering or attracting, trusting, and stay focused. Because you are this butterfly that is evolving and you have the spirit surrounding you. No matter how people try to attack you, no matter how people look at you, no matter how many times people snare their nose up at you, you have 
sovereignty. You have the spirit of the Lord upon you. I say you have the spirit of the creator upon you. You have the spirit of the most high upon you. That energy is upon you. I don't give a fuck if you are attracted to the same sex. That has nothing to do with spirit. That has nothing to do with your spirituality. Ashe, and people need to stop trying to tear this community down for that. Ashe, spirit is sane. People have, it doesn't matter what people perceive of you. People are born to live in their own will. Ashe, and that is fucking what's wrong with this world because society has placed so many stipulations and so many um, condemning, um, 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 condemning, um, I don't even know how to put it, but condemn people in so many different ways and judge people in so many different ways because they want to live freely and they don't want to live in the box like the masses. Ashe, um, um, being condemned to what, um, they told you to do or what, um, that Bible, um, says the Bible has been rewritten a hundred times and a hundred times and a million times over. Ashe, we do not really know what that Bible of that metaphor really holds. Ashe, and we will never really know, but our spirits know. We know what we hold on the inside. We know that we are connected to spirit, whether we be connected to the same sex or not. Ashe. And I'm saying we because I'm just putting myself in your shoes right now. Ashe. Because I am reading for your energy right now. Ashe. Ashe. Thank you, Divine Spirit, for that um, confirmation. And Spirit is saying, connect with the ameth amethyst because it's going to bring you closer to your higher self. It's going to bring you closer to your acceptance. It's going to bring you closer to um, your knowledge, attracting your power, indulging into your intuition. Okay? Getting closer to spirit, Ashe, your sovereignty. Ashe. Before I pick those up, spirit wanted me to focus on what you need to cut out your life so you can be able to accept yourself. Because spirit is saying some of you are not accepting yourselves. And the feelings that you have because um, you're being condemned for it, Ashe. You're being um, ridiculed for it, Ashe. You're being put down for it, Ashe. You're being shunned, Ashe. You're being, you're given the evil eye, Ashe. And Spirit is saying, um, rebuke that energy, Ashe. Rebuke that because they're trying to provoke you. They're trying to provoke you. These, these these body snatchers and, and these karmic energies are trying to provoke you, Ashe. I'm, I'm scared of saying it could be some 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 karmic energy out there. Um, um, this is for masculine and feminine energy, Ashe. Same sex energy, Ashe. But you could be in a same sex relationship, Ashe. And it could be a karmic out there that you once used to because we are in the retrograde situation right now. And the past is trying to come back. The past always tries to resurface, Ashe. So you could be in the same sex situation, Ashe. Being a man or being a woman. But used to... Having an ex that was the opposite sex, Ashe, and this is a karmic trying to come back, spirit is saying, Ashe, so you could be a man in a relationship with a man, but once, once dated a woman, and that woman is trying to come back, 
Ashe, or you could be a woman in the same sex situation, Ashe, with a woman and once dated a man, and that man is trying to come back. Thank you, Divine Spirit, for breaking it down. Um, clear and accurate, Ashe. Because they feel like you are Mr. Perfect or you are Mrs. Perfect, Ashe. Oops, fucking A. Look at it. Karmic, don't want me to... Look at that. Don't want me to even say what needs to be said. Fucking up these cards like that. Don't be fucking up my cards. Shit. Keep your negative energy where it be. I say, don't fuck them. Don't, don't try to come this way. Try to fuck up nothing in this reading. I say, I rebuke that energy right now. I say, you cannot dwell up in this place. I say, thank you, Divine Spirit. Okay, let's keep it. Let's keep it above. Let's keep it 100. Thank you, Divine Spirit. What? I invoke, oh, excuse me. I invoke the energy to connect to, uh, I invoke the powers to connect to the energies of the Divine Collective. Um, same sex um, 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 community, LGBTQ community, I say. I invoke the powers to connect to the energies of them and all those who dwell around them, I say. Thank you for that reminder. Someone is trying to keep you confused, I say. They want you, but um, they want they want you, but they talk to other people. Want you, but talks to other people. They're interested in. Okay, so. Someone is trying to, to lead you on, Ashe. Whether this be same sex or whether this be that energy that I was just talking about, Ashe. Knowing that they don't really want you, Ashe. But they know that you are perfect, Ashe. They know that you are um, God-given, Ashe. They know that you... Um, have family standards, Ashe. And so, <clears throat> they're not feeling good enough, Ashe. A poser, Ashe. They can, like, they're happy. So, someone in this relationship, in this dynamic, in this partnership, in this, um, could be platonic, working relationship, whatever, um, I'm not going to say whatever. I'm going to say whatever resonates with you, Ashe. Or this could be you because you're not accepting or somebody's not accepting you. But this could be you posing and faking like you are happy, Ashe, because you are in a, a relationship that you do not want to be in, Ashe, um, which could be a, a relationship of the opposite sex, Ashe, this, this, red, take it as it resonates, and that scratching at the door is confirmation, Ashe, it's confirmation. One second, it's always an interruption, Ashe, the spirit is saying that there's nothing that's going to be able to interrupt you, Ashe, with your progress and, and moving forward, Ashe. Thank you, Divine Spirits, for that confirmation. Um, but, um, yes, yeah, somebody is posing happy. Somebody is acting like they're happy, but they're truly not happy on the inside. They're, they're, they're showing um, fake happiness. And this could be somebody who is in, a, yeah, like I said, a, um, a, a opposite sex relationship that wants to be um, truly, rightfully in in their energy of being in the same sex relationship, they're miserable because somebody is out there married, but um, wants to be with a man. Somebody's out there married to a woman that wants to be with a man, and somebody's out there married to um, um, somebody's married to a woman that wants to be a man, and somebody some woman is married to a man that wants to be with a woman. I say so. Um, posing like um, you're happy, but you're not happy because you want that same-sex relationship, Ashe. 
and then it's some out there that's posing that they're happy when you're not happy because you you want to come out the closet as they put it you want to live free in 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 your in your um choice of who you want to be in a relationship with ashe so there's some avoidance ashe um it's avoidance ashe it's resistance ashe malice so you're you're receiving some malice um energy somebody's refusing take refusing to take responsibility and is trying to ruin your reputation because you are in a same sex relationship because you want to be in a same sex relationship or because they know as their wife they know as them being a wife you being their husband they know that you are sleeping around with men. And so they're holding this over your head. Ashe, someone is wants to ruin your reputation because of that. You could be sleeping around, um, married to a man. And you could be in um, a high stature of um, employment. And so... Something about that. It's it's not coming to me right now, but it's coming to me. So something is canceled. Plans are canceled because it's too much confusion, Ashe, going on in your life. So something has been canceled in your life. Maybe this relationship, maybe um I don't know, but you have a stalker as well. An insecure man or female. If we talked about that one, that wanting to come back, that energy wanting to come back with, when you were in um, opposite sex dynamic. Now that you are in same sex dynamic, you have that opposite sex stalking you. Or you can have, it could be the same sex stalking you. Uh, and the ex, we are in retrograde. This under. Landed on top of number 44, master number. So, Spirit is saying stay stay balanced and, and um, <clears throat> stay focused because somebody is stalking you. It could be on the internet. It could be in your neighborhood. It could be at your grocery store. It could be at your local gym, your park. But somebody is stalking you and they're very insecure. Ashe. So, Spirit is saying make sure you keep... That old energy out of your life, Ashe. If you cut them out, do not let them back in, Ashe. And um, they know that they are being replaced or have been replaced. And this person that you replaced or is about to replace, this person is hooking up with other people. So you could be in the same sex dynamic, but um, it's having some insecurities about being in the same side, same sex dynamic. And while you're having these insecurities going through these emotions, your partner is out there hooking up with other people, Spirit is saying. Take it as it resonates. Bitter. So whoever is having this avoidance is bitter. For some reason, a bad guy or a bad girl gone wrong. So this could be the ex of the opposite sex or the ex of the same sex. But someone out there is bitter because you're, you're avoiding them. You won't talk to them. You won't communicate with them. Maybe this is the person that um, was slandering you, was trying to condemn you, Ashe, for wanting to be in a same-sex relationship, feeling entitled. Someone is feeling entitled. Whoever was being malice towards you, feeling entitled. Ashe, so this could be um, this could be a mother or father. 
Ashe being having malice towards you because they don't want you in the same sex dynamic. Ashe, this could be um the same your 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 partner feeling entitled um to you, whoever you walked away from, Ashe. But whoever this is, um They feel like they are supposed to live a privileged life and treat other people like shit. So, they're treating you like shit. Spirit is saying why they feel like they should live a privileged life. Schooling. So, Spirit is saying somebody wants to go back to school. Somebody has learned a hard lesson, but they didn't need to learn. Whew. This energy right here. You got some frenemies. So, so somebody is out there acting like they're okay with you being in the same sex relationship, but they're lying to you behind your back. You have some frenemies. Some people are envious because you can be live free in your same sex dynamic and, and they are mad about it. They are envious about it. So they're being your frenemies. I say you can't trust people. Spirit said, have, the, have a provoking came out again. Because you canceled someone in your life because they was calling, causing so much confusion. Now they want to provoke you. Ashe, wanting a negative reaction out of you. And Spirit is saying, do not give them that negative reaction out of you. Ashe, make sure you stay with a clear, focused mind. Ashe, this could be your stalker. Ashe, this could be that family member. This could be that... Um, ex-lover, Ashe, convenient friend. They were a convenient friend because they felt like you were perfect, Ashe. They felt like you thought you was better than everyone else because you could stand out uh, or, or take it as a resume. Some of you could stand out on on um, having the bold um, and having the courage and the strength to say that I am from the LBG L L G B T Q community. You were able to stand up against these people and say, this is what I stand for. And they, they feel like you are Miss Perfect or Mr. Perfect because of that. So they wanted to be your convenient friends, not a true friend, Ashe, because they were trollops, Ashe. And they did things for, you know, um, material gain, money gain, Ashe. And they seen that you had this, Ashe. So this is something that they wanted from you, Ashe. Being malice, Ashe. Being that poser, Ashe. And now that you're avoiding them, they're bitter as fuck, Ashe. And they feel like you betrayed them. Ashe, which really, they betrayed you. Ashe, be, be, habitual time wasters is what they were. And Spirit is saying, continue to keep them cut out of your life, Ashe. Because they always trying to throw you under the bus. Because you are a brave soul to stand up in your truth, Ashe. You are a truth seeker. You are a truth teller, Ashe. For some of you out there, you're not ashamed, Ashe. And you have accepted yourself fully. And others, you are trying to um, surrender to accepting yourself fully because of, um, because of the wrath. Because of the wrath and, and the malice and the betrayal that they always put you in, Ashe. Ashe. Starburst! Starburst! Excuse me. Excuse me, y'all. We got the Queen of Pentacles. Starburst, stop it. Knock it. We got the Queen of Pentacles. So you are a stable, um, loving parent, Ashe. You um if you don't have to be a parent, Ashe, but you are a stable um soul, Ashe, a caring soul, uh, um, uh, um hard-working soul. Ashe, you have, you are, um, we have the page of wands, so new creative, um, passionate, um, 
ideas are coming in into play, Ashe. And then I see you could be of a, a island descent, Ashe. And you could be a, um you could be a male that cross dresses, Ashe. Thank you, Divine Spirit, with this um Queen of Pentacles. You could be a male that likes to cross dress. Or you are a male embodying the feminine energy, Ashe. And you can also be from the islands of um, an island descent, Ashe. Thank you, Divine Spirit. But you got that holy cloud in, in, in back of you. Um, backing you up. So, the sovereignty, Ashe. I see um, water sign. So you could be a water sign, Ashe. You could be a fire sign, Ashe. I see the sun. You are a star, Ashe. The messenger. So you are a messenger, Ashe. You come to speak, Ashe. You come to stand up for your truth, Ashe. Spirit is saying. You come to stand up for the LGBT. Q community spirit is saying Ashe you have embodied that um, supernatural energy to withstand the malice the betrayal the bitterness that people um, the confusion that people want to place into your lives Ashe Queen of Cups you are a loving kind considerate emo emotionally st stable person, Ashe, and Spirit is saying that is the truth with this Knight of Swords, Ashe. So we have a Knight of Swords, Ashe, that want to come towards you, Ashe, but for some reason your back is turned against the Knight of Swords, Ashe. So this could be someone in your past trying to come in impulsively, and Spirit has your back. This loving Spirit has its back turned to this impulsive energy, Ashe. And spirit, spirit is saying that is the truth. We have the three of pentacles. So we have someone that wants to collaborate with you, Ashe. Someone is willing to stand up with you in your truth. Ashe, someone loves you genuinely, Ashe, Spirit is saying, and that's right under this Queen of Pentacles, Ashe, uh, you, it's some out there that have proud grandmas, that have proud um, moms, Ashe, that are proud of their trans children, Ashe, Spirit is saying, Four of Pentacles, someone is working hard to um, invest in their money, or somebody is Holding on to you, holding on to your energy. That could be that past energy, Ashe. We have the Nine of Swords. Someone is trapped in a mental mind confliction. Maybe because they have not surrendered. Take the energy as it resonates. There's a lot of you collectives out there. And some of you are trapped in your mental minds because you have not surrendered. And you, you are afraid to come to the open. Or this could be um, these couples that are in these um, opposite sex situations that are trapped in their mental minds because they want to be in the same sex situation. Same sex dynamic. Ashe, but this is the Nine of Swords. Ashe, that's mental. Ashe, we have all the signs on the board. Earth, water, fire, and air. Ashe, we have the King of Wands. Ashe, so that, that like we said, coming from the past, that, that nostalgia, that Six of Cups, Ashe, trying to come and um, love you down. But only because they feel like you're perfect, only because they feel privileged, only because they want your life or want what you have in your life. Spirit is saying that is the truth with this sword, this king of swords. So Spirit is saying keep the, the, the logic, the knowledge, the wisdom, 
Keep them cut out of your life. Ashe, continue to move forward. Ashe, with this Five of Pentacles, continue to walk away from these people that are posers. Continue to walk away from these people that keep you in confusion. Ashe, that do not uphold the, st the family standards that you uphold. Ashe, that want to bring malice to you because you believe in yourself, because you live freely, because you have sovereignty, sovereignty, because they see the spirit of the Lord on you. They see the light shine through you, even though they try to judge you and condemn you for what you, um, you what you desire, what you prefer. Ashe. Their, their perceptions against you. Starburst. <clears throat> I'm not going to tell you again. The Six of Swords. You sailed away from that shit. Ashe. You sailed away to calmer waters. Ashe. And Spirit is saying, stay. The Ten of Swords. You brought shit to an end. They were trying to put you in bad health. Ashe. And, 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 um, Hurt your heart. And spirit is saying you deserve new beginnings with this ace of pentacles. Ashe, you went from a four of pentacles to an ace of pentacles. One second, please. You went from a four of pentacles to an ace of pentacles. Ashe, with the, the whining of the cats. Confirmation. So because you... You have been um, in this nine of swords or somebody is in this nine of swords because you're about to receive a new cup of love. Someone who is going to accept you or someone um, who is going to love you or you, you just a new partnership. It don't even have to be love. It could be a partnership. Ashe. It's the cup of it's the start of some love. Ashe. Then we have the, the page of pentacles, Ashe. New beginnings, Ashe. It, you could be um, in, in a relationship where they could be younger than you, Ashe. But Spirit is saying it's new. Then we have the knight of pentacles, Ashe. So you, you have... You are buying. We have the Ten of Wands coming to an end. Things are coming to an end. No more burdens because of this situation. Some of you are burdened by this situation of people judging you, Ashe, and, and, and not taking you seriously, Ashe. Ashe. So that is coming to an end. Walking away again. They're going to be mad because you're walking away from them. Ashe, oh my goodness. Ashe, it's so many interruptions. These, these, these entities are mad and angry. Upset. So many interruptions. These entities are mad and upset. These people with these malice hearts, these people that cause confusion, they are mad and upset. So many interruptions. They're trying to interrupt your life. Ashe, thank you, Divine Spirit, for that. Ashe, we're here again. Ashe. So, Spirit is saying, continue to live in your truth. Continue to live in your truth. Because you're being blessed twice with the Ace of Pentacles. Twice. Spirit, it doesn't matter what sex you, you um, it, it doesn't matter. You living in the same, with the same gender has nothing to do with the spirit. Ace of Wands, once again. Not, nothing to do with spirit. New projects, inspirations. Um, passion, energy, you know, enthusiasm. This is what's coming upon your life because you want to live in, in your truth, Ashe. Creative sparks. 
you being this speaker, you being this motivational for, for your community, this motivational speaker for your community, you standing up for your community. Ashe, spirit knows that, that this is what's in your heart and this is what's going to come about. Ashe, thank you, Divine Spirit. Any more, um, any more energy? The Seven of Swords. Betrayal, deception. Ashe, you walked away from that. You, you, we seen that with the five of pentacles twice, Ashe, because they stole from you. They was dishonest from you because they felt like you was perfect, Ashe, with their sneakiness, Ashe, with their strategies and their scheming, Ashe, being cunning towards you, Ashe, being malice towards you, Ashe. Spirit says, stay away from these people, Ashe. This, the nine of wands. Wounded warrior, you made it through. Perseverance, resilience, testing of faith, all that you were tested. Now you you are um close to your success and your gifts, Ashe. Being this motivational speaker, having this platform, Ashe, standing up for your community, Ashe, standing up for your community at work, Ashe, or in your family. It could be several family members that you all um, embody this energy of um, loving on the same sex. It's okay. We all have um, that energy in our family, Ashe. So, if we all have that energy in our family, don't you think that it should be normalized? Don't you think that it is normal if every one of us out of, out of the whole world all have this energy in our families? Don't you think it's, 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 it should be deemed right? Ashe, I, I, that's just my thought. Ashe, and we have the Nine of Pentacles. We got... Right on top of this, um, Queen of Cups, Ashe. So you, if you, you, whatever energy you embody, whether it be a masculine or feminine energy, you are dynamically beautiful or dynamically fine, handsome, Ashe. In your in your avatar, Ashe, you are loving and emotionally stable and balanced, Ashe. You are well secure with your finances, Ashe. Ashe, you have new endeavors coming into your life, Ashe. Um, whether you, if you already started your platforms, if you already started your new businesses, Ashe. The Seven of Wands, Ashe, you are divinely protected by spirit, Ashe. Spirit protects you, spirit loves you. You, you are standing firm. And if you have not already started to do this, you will start to do this. You will surrender to the spirit of how you feel. You will surrender to sovereignty and knowing that you live a, a righteous life no matter if you are in the same sex dynamic. Ashe, you will have the courage, the new beginnings to step out on surrendering to spirit with this full energy. Ashe, thank you, Divine Spirit, for that confirmation. Ashe, you will receive your nine of cups, your wish fulfillment. Ashe, right on top of this seven of wands. Ashe, these people that have been deceitful and scheming and, and, and stealing and, and stealing your joy, stealing your money, stealing your happiness. Ashe, because of this, you will be blessed, stealing, stealing, making you feel some type of way because you are in the same sex relationship. Ashe, you will have your wish fulfillment. Ashe, look at this shit. This. I see the chariot. I see the ten of pentacles. Ashe. I see a lot going on. We're not going to take all those. We're going to start over. Thank you, Divine Spirit. You could be a Rebecca. You could be a, Re a Marie. You could be a Sam. You could be a Joseph. 
confirmation. You could be an Allen. You could be 25. You could be 29, 22. You could be a laugh, laugh, a laughing partner. <laughs> you could be a life path. Number eight, Ashe. Your name could be Crystal, Ashe. We have the, the world. So you, right now, you are being blessed with the world. Accomplishments. Um, you might be getting ready to travel, Ashe. But Spirit is saying, see the bigger picture of you standing in your sovereignty. Your harmony. You are being... You are having fulfillment, Ashe, right on top of the Nine of Wands. Ashe, you being this wounded warrior, Ashe. So, Spirit is saying, <clears throat> no worries. The lover, you have the lover. Divine love is coming into your life. So, whoever, maybe you had, you were in a relationship where um, they thought they wanted to be in the same sex relationship, but realized they didn't want to. And spirit is going to bless you with that divine love that is not um, afraid to um, stand up and 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 have the courage to be um, um, bold and free. Ashe. Spirit is saying there will be no more heartbreaks, no more emotional pains and sorrow and trauma, Ashe, because you will continue to have that shit cut out your life, Ashe. There will be no more depressions and loss, heartbreaks, Ashe, Ashe, because the emperor or empress is going to embark into your life, Ashe, this new love. I say this lovers, I say this union, this balance, this unity, I say with that cat scratching over there. Oh my goodness, this reading has had so many interruptions. So spirit is saying something is about to interrupt your life so this new beginning can come. You're about to have some kind of tower so this new beginning can take place in your life in, in, in um, the LGBT community, I say. Um, you are about to have a breakthrough. So continue to surrender and continue to have avoidance toward these, these people from the past during this retrograde. Ashe, Ashe, thank you, Divine Spirit, for that confirmation, Ashe. And like Spirit says, if the curses do not apply to you, leave them on the table because it's somebody else's shit that they need to clean up. And if the blessings do not apply to you, leave it on the table. Because it's somebody else's blessings that they need to scoop up and prosper with. But if it is yours, pick that shit up and, and, and clean it up. Those curses. And if they are your blessings, scoop it up and make it prosper into something bigger. Flourish it into something bigger and brighter. Spirit is saying because they are giving you the key. Ashe, they are um, handing you um, the knowledge and the wisdom. Ashe, they have already, um, you have already um, wrote out the plans. Ashe, before you were even born. Ashe, so Spirit is saying, um, take my hand. Ashe, so we're going to get some Oracle love cards. Ashe, my cards is always honeymoon so spirit is saying this new love will lead to a honeymoon i say enjoy the bliss and holidays together so it may be during the holiday times that you will come together i say but spirit is saying um there will be bliss there will be new love there will be a honeymoon i say there will be boldness and 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 and, and um um engagement so you're going to be engaged i say your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment so if you have not already started this engagement you will soon be in a gay in an engagement or you will meet someone who is going to want to um be engaged to you spirit is saying thank you divine spirit for that confirmation i 
chemistry. You will have chemistry with this person. And Spirit is saying, always have heart-to-heart -heart conversations with this person. It is safe to love this person. If you are not already in this person's life or this person is not already in your life, this person will come into your life and it will be safe to love and they will they will love you they will be your soulmate and they will love you truly and they that you will you will you will feel the dynamic of the love um knowing that they are not ashamed to be in this relationship a same sex relationship ashe ashe so take the messages as they resonate Ashe Spirit is saying, surrender. If you are feeling uncomfortable and you have not accepted yourself as yet, surrender to that. And Spirit is saying, if there is someone out there that has a perception against you and cannot accept you, Spirit is saying, avoid these people. Spirit is saying, it, it is mothers out there that truly love you, but don't know how to tell you that they truly love you. Ashe it is truly family members out there that don't know how to tell you that they truly love you because of the stipulations that have been put on by society against the masses when they when it comes to this um, tender and precious um, situation. Ashe, so spirit is saying, continue to stand in your truth, or continue to to. To have um, courage in yourself to be able to stand in your truth. Ashe. And Spirit is saying, if you are living in a marriage and, and you are married to the opposite sex. Confirmation. Look, shit is crawling on me. Spirit is saying that it's demonic. And you need to get out of that situation because it's not healthy for the person that you are in that opposite sex with because you are going behind that person's back cheating with the same sex. And that is not healthy. And we have the healthy um, card. Somebody is, is health is not good. We we got that um, in this in this reading. I, I know I've seen it. But um. I'm pretty sure I've seen it. But yeah. It's somewhere. Or was it in the last reading? I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, I know I see that shit. It's somewhere. It's, uh, but I ain't finna look for it. But anyways. Spirit is saying it's not healthy. So stop it. It's demonic. If you if, if you're gonna be in the same sex relationship, be in that same sex relationship. Don't go back taking those energies to someone who maybe does know or somebody who doesn't know because it's it's still it's demonic. Ashe. So spirit is saying, knock it off. And spirit is saying, um, they commend you for standing in your truth, in your boldness, and and, and, and not having fear to live out your truth. Ashe. And spirit is going to bless you with the new, the, the, the world. The world is in your hand. You got the nine of cups. You got the world. You got the lovers. That's all you need to have a stable life. Ashe, that's all you need. So I'm blessing you all with my pure love, light, and positive energy coming from the ethers through me to you, Ashe, for this um this reading, Ashe, sending all my sending some of my loving healing energy. I cannot send y'all all my loving healing energy. Then what would I have for myself? So I'm sending you some of it, Ashe, a piece of it, Ashe, to to embark on you in your day, Ashe, to uplift you in your day. This is a divine reading, Ashe. I I um am wishing that it is confirmation for someone that it it, it resonates with someone, Ashe, Ashe. And so I am um wishing that peace be in you, as it is within me, Ashe. And just smile, because. You have the grace and the honor, the sovereignty 
of the Holy Spirit. Ashe, Ashe.